Hey everybody, Papa Gord here again, and I guess we're gonna keep rolling with um, more figures. <laughs> so we did um, Elo Asti or Elo Asti or however you want to pronounce his name um, last time. So I guess we're gonna keep going with like Force Awakens. Um, yeah, I guess Force Awakens. So we'll go more sequel than prequel or whatever. But anyways, uh, enough of the rambling. So, I guess we'll... Next easiest figure for me to grab off my shelf is uh, Ian McShane. You know, the Rebel Pilot Ian McShane. Um, as portrayed by Ian McShane. Yeah, so... Poe Dameron, Ian McShane. I don't see Oscar Isaacs in this figure even remotely at all. It's just, yeah, not good. The rest, no problem. Hey, like like I said in the, uh, the last video, like stormtroopers, like troopers, can't go wrong, and guys or gals in pilot flight suits again never a bad thing they draw your eye to them like this is yeah I I like the look but yeah he's just so sad 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 Ian McShane and uh, so yeah so anyways so he's basically the exact same as his uh, his brother in arms. Now, um, a few little differences, but again, right? Like he's alien. He's Ian McShane. Um, so I mean, the flight suits aren't the same color. He's a little bit lighter orange. Um, I find that all the detail down on his lower leg. It's a lot more pronounced, or at least just the paint job on mine anyways. Um, I find his really stand out. There's a lot of silver in that, where this is a lot of more of a dull wash. So, um, and then there comes to like the harness, basically the same, um, his little box thing that runs into his, his leg. Um, Again, it's the same thing. It limits his posability just like uh, Asti's here. And then, I don't know if my if mine's because of an imperfect... Like, I'd have no idea. But, you look how his holster sits. And here, I'm going to put him down for a second. And we'll slide. So, this is one of the accessories he comes with. So, basically... Um, I guess an X-Wing pilot's sidearm, I suppose. Um, and... Yeah. So, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if it's just kind of... Choices. And then, obviously, there's another difference. Um, in the color. So, silver. Silver and gold from that... Uh, that uh, one Christmas uh, puppetry cartoony thing. Anyways, <laughs> I don't know. It was a very long day at work, but um, yeah. So I don't know if the, if if that's just or I mean, this looks more right than this, but I really like the look of this opposed to this. Um, but I don't know. Let me know down in the comments if you've got both. Let me know if yours are the same. But um, let's just do a quick comparison of the side arms here. So, so Asti's again, he's got the black on the handle. Pose, no, nothing. And silver tip. So, again, it is the same, but different color. So that's something, something I didn't even know. But yeah, so I mean, he can hold it well enough and... Um, goes into his uh, holster okay and also has his let's not do the middle finger 
uh, his his X-wing helmet, which is very cool. Uh, I like the colors on it. I do like his like his helmet in general. So um, I think it's really striking with the gray and the blacks and the reds. And uh, yeah, so get it on his head. This one, we're good. Yeah, I think we're okay. So this is usually the way I kind of have them on my shelf. Usually I have any of my guys that have helmets, usually have them holding them or underneath the arm or something like that to, to get, you know, look on his face. This is the face that I want to keep covered up. So, hence why he gets this on. So it takes away from the look that's underneath. The horror that's underneath. But they don't need to remake this. At all. N no. We don't We don't need another Pilot Poe. Um, so yeah. So we'll take off the helmet for now. And then, yeah, I almost forgot. He does come with one more accessory. And that's uh, because I have that box put away. Because I have no intentions of swapping out his uh, his piloting gloves um, because as you can see there's no bend but he can do a Luke Skywalker or is that the wrong hand it's probably the wrong hand it's the wrong hand I think yeah but yeah so he comes with interchangeable hands that have just a little bit more of the flight suit and then bare skinned hands interesting that's pretty much all I have to say is it's why him uh, don't know absolutely no idea did they need to do him no he's all gloved up he you know he's got nothing he's got regular jointy wrists and the whole bit no pop-off motion uh, even Luke in his pilot in his x-wing gear That's, yeah. But, but he, but he comes with, I don't know. But if, anyways, um, the range is basically the same as well. He's, you know, he does have some, a little bit of crunch, not so much in the back. You know, he's got a good turn. His head movement is absolutely a joke because he can't go any farther back. And he really can't, I mean, Asti's got a whole hell of a lot more head range. Um, yeah. You know, again, doesn't get quite the 90. They could have easily, again, put that longer cut in and at least got him 90, if not a smidge more. Um, but, yeah, I mean, you know, he's if you get his, his straps out of the way, no, he can't quite kick his own backside. But, uh, and again, you're limited, limited on this side because of his hosing going down into his leg his knee but uh yeah so that's uh pilot uh ian mcshane oh and also um i don't know about yours if you even have this one but my one foot on this guy is crazy loose um so i, I always usually try to <sighs> he falls over quite a bit which is a shame because of the, the hindrance here, I can't really put him in that dynamic of a pose. So he usually has to uh, do a, a little bit of leaning because if he tends to go, he tends to go back. But uh, but yeah, that's uh, again, Pilot Poe, uh, one of uh, what four four poses that we have right now, I think. Um, I know I don't have them all yet. That, that two pack, I have that coming. So I, 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 yeah. When there's nothing new to get and you can get your hands on stuff, um, a little bit of backlog that you don't have that's still either cheaper than retail or retail, uh, you tend to jump on it. So um, as much as I, I want to put my, my pennies away for the Order 66 or Han and the Tauntaun, you know, some other. Uh, pieces I'm looking for. I think this two pack is I think the last of the newer ish figures. So at least I have I think I'm complete. So I'm up to date on everybody and uh, 
I don't have every individual release, but I've got, you know, like the Deluxe Sky Old Man Luke opposed to the regular box edition, um, you know, like the Deluxe one's better. So anyways, uh, so yeah, so I don't know. Let me know what you guys uh, thought. Um, honestly, like, between the two, if we had to have a, a pilot off, he, he'd be gone. So, and uh, Asti here would be would be the champion. But um, as it is, yeah. So not not the best. Um, I appreciate again. I appreciate the fact of it's it's a it's a pilot, beat an X wing, but it's it's a rebel pilot. And I appreciate that. I do appreciate that you get his uh, pistol. You get a really nice detailed helmet. And, yeah, okay. And he has removable hands. So, I mean, that's cool that we got it. Maybe not the right figure for it. But, anyways, just my thoughts, just my opinions. But, uh, you know, as always, let me know down in the comments. Um... And then uh, the usual YouTube mumbo jumbo, like, share, subscribe, and we will see you guys very soon. So have a good day.